Christ. <clears throat> Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Draft Battle Breakdown. I'm your host, uh, Wallace Locomotive, also known as Ben Donaldson. And today we're, co we're covering Jake and Josh's fight. Now, I hope this is a quick one because I have some grub to go eat. So um, <laughs> let's make this snappy, shall we? So let's start the battle. So we see Perserker and Armourouge hit the field. Now, you know, very scary matchup for Jake here. However, Jake goes for the fake out. You know, get, a, get that little chip damage in, you know, while you can. Uh, Josh go, Josh's weak armor pops. Gets a two times speed. However, weaker defense. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Josh. If this guy has crunch, you're done for. No, no, I'm just, jo I'm just joshing you, Josh. Josh has a... Uh, fire moves and is faster than Berserker. So we will see um we'll see the switch into Tatsugiri, a water dragon. You know, expecting the fire move. Um however it is quad resisted by Tatsugiri. Um however he doesn't go for the fire move. He goes for the reflect and then the light screen. Um playing very defensively here Josh and that's very smart against Jake's powerhouse of a team. You know, it's only really real um you know non combat Pokemon is Sylveon and Tatsugiri. And all of his other ones. Ooh. So we see the Surf. Super effective 49. If that, um, if the light screen wasn't there, it would have definitely knocked out Armor Rouge. So that's, uh, you know, that's, that's something. Then we see Armor Rouge take another Surf. As we see, this was a speed tie. Um, Armor Rouge, you know, moved faster on turn three. However, lost to Tatsugiri in where it mattered. So Armor Rouge goes down. Very scary for Josh. Um, he was... You know, using Armourouge defensively, that's smart. Uh, so then we see the floor just come out. Floor just, you know, is a babe. Um, is a good, you know, like staller. So let's see what floor just does. Uh, we we see the switch into Ursaring from Jake. Ursaring's a scary Pokemon. I was gonna get Ursaring, however, I decide against it because you know it doesn't really fit the dynamic of my team as well. So Florges then goes for the Calm Mind, and then the Calm Mind again, really setting up against Jake here, ready for the sweep with Florges. And Florges definitely can sweep um, with Mystical Fire for Perserker. Um, literally any fairy move for Tatsugiri, Dragapult, and Titar. Uh, and then coverage, I'm, I'm going to guess it has Flash Cannon for Sylveon. Um, oh wait, no. So we see the body slam hit um, <clears throat> contact, and we see the paralyze. Ursaring got really lucky there. You know the paralyze matters, as you will see later in the match. Um, so leftovers heal. Then we see the switch to Sylveon, and you know Sylveon's a good Pokemon, a very bulky Pokemon, very bulky. Um, how are fairy against fairy? <laughs> Between the two, Florges has this. Um, so we see the calm mind from Florges. Uh, and then we see the, um, then we see Calm Mind from Sylveon, and then the Calm Mind from Florges. Um, okay, then we see Calm Mind from Sylveon, Calm Mind from Florges, okay. Then we see, um, Reflect wears off, then we see Calm Mind from Sylveon, and then C Calm Mind from Florges. Okay, you know what, um, I think... I think it's going to go on like this for a while. So I'm just going to um, let's play. So here's, here's currently my team for Michael. Um, you know, it's, it's a pretty good team. I'm thinking of putting Earthquake, Facade, Fire Fang, and Ice Fang on this guy. Good coverage. Um, and then giving him the Choice Band, make him really strong. Uh, Orthworm, same kind of deal. Earthquake. I might give him Coil. Um... And then Iron Head, definitely. And then Iron Defense. Make him even bulkier. Um, and then for this guy, give him the um, give him the Life Orb. Make him stronger. Uh, Copperaja. This guy's going to be my uh, setup. -er, Mr. Setup. Actually, he doesn't <laughs> he doesn't do well. With that. Sorry, that was a joke. Um, high Earthquake. Giving him Earthquake as well. Um, actually, you got Facade, right? Oh, shit. Give you the, the um, Flame Orb. Duh. Um, sheer force, absolutely. 100%. Earthquake, heavy slam. Um, outrage and play rough. Um, and then with you, let's give you the expert belt. Oh, let's see how the battle's doing. Oh, sh are you serious? Alright. 
Appleton. This this guy's gonna set up. Curse. Iron Defense. Light Screen. And of course, Earthquake. Especially defensive. And for you. Let's give you let's give you the Rocky Helmet. You. You know, Earthquake. Just because. Disable. Chilling Water. Calm Mind. Bulky Special Sweeper. And for you, we'll give you the... Uh, what was that one? Dark. Oh, you can't <clears throat> search. What is it? It's not Chapel. Oh, here we go. Cold Burberry. Oh, no, let's give you Regenerator. <clears throat> Finally, some floor. In fact, I actually know um, what's some floor I'm going to use. I'm just going to copy you and then uh, go into here. Delete. Paste. And there we go. There's our team for Michael. That was pretty easy. Michael, this is the team I'm using. And just so you know, this is this is what it's going to be like. Um, me against you. Up next, the Shmoo Star Press. This is another top rope move. Which is um, so this is me, and that's you. So, yeah, this guy's me. And it goes down, and he goes, whoa. Air, and then it lands on you. That's, that's just how it's going to go. Finally, oh my god, are you serious? Okay, well... I'm done with my team, so, like, let's just. This is unbelievable. This is outrageous. Can I just play Google Minesweeper? Easy. You, 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 you. You. You're good. You're good. You're good. Oh, 17 seconds. I think that's a PR for me. I'm going to be real. Oh, my God. Are, are you being so for real right now? We see the hyper voice. Okay. Let's just watch it out. See what happens. Wish. Paralyze. Hyper voice. Moonblast. Oh, Sylvia and Mike go down. Nope. <sighs> Hyper voice. Wish. Oh, Flores might go down. Oh my god. It did. It went down. Oh my god. All right. After how many turns was that? After 18 turns, we finally get to see a new Pokemon hit the field. And who's it going to be? Iron Treads. All right, Iron Treads. Let's make this a quick sweep, all right? You can sweep every single Pokemon on his team. Every single one of them. Except maybe Dragapult, because he wants Flamethrower. So let's say, Iron Treads goes for the Iron Head. Ooh, does a lot of damage. 63, that's fantastic for Iron Treads. I don't know why he didn't do this earlier. Sylveon flinched. Fantastic. That means Iron Treads can get another Iron Head off. Kill this son of a bitch. Oh my god. Jake, let it die. Let it die. Just let it die, dude. Oh my god. Jo Jake. Josh, kill this, kill this thing. Iron Head, great. Great. Oh wait, no, it has Fake Out. It has Fake Out. Okay, here comes the flinch. Earthquake. Earthquake. Okay. Actually, let's 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 go back on that. That fake out did six. And then leftovers healed it back up to 99. It did one damage. That fake out did one damage. Then we see the substitute. Jake pulls out the close combat. Finally, we get to see some attacks. Um So you see the close combat. Substitute fails. Iron treads. Hits the Earthquake. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. However, Berserker eats the Shookaberry. And it lives on six, which is very beneficial for Jake, as we see here with the close combat. Get out of here, Iron Treads. Get out of here. So Iron Treads goes down, finally, with Berserker now at very low defenses. It's safe to say Jake is going to sack this mod. Uh, but he will get one more fake out. What? Now you don't go for the fake out, dude. That's it. That's when you give your. That's when you use the fake out. 
get some get some damage on this guy. Whatever. He goes down and he sends out Ursaring. Ursaring, heavy hitter. You know the whole story. I'm electric terrain, body slam. Exactly half. Wow, it did exactly half. I'm I'm sorry, guys. I I'm a little stressed out. I everybody's pressuring me to make this video fantastic, and I am a little mad because this is my second time recording this video and it's just not fun. This battle isn't fun. I knew what happened. I'm breaking the floor. We know what happens. We act surprised. We know what happens. We all know what happens. And I think it's time for you guys to wake up and realize that this is, the battles are real, but our reactions to them are fake. They're fake. Everything is fake. Body slam does exactly half. Heavy hitter. Wow. Electric terrain. That's set up so that so that Josh Josh's iron Pokemon can really get really get some some good attacks in. Electros goes for the brick break, bringing Urshring down to only 70. Only 30 damage? That's crazy. Only 30 damage. Urshring brings back the Body Slam and finishes off Electros. Now, this is looking very scary for Josh. Josh only has two Pokemon left. An Iron Thorns and, 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 and Iron Jugulus. So, what's Josh going to do? Well, Josh is going to, Josh is going to, you know, use his Air Balloon and Earthquake and, or, or, so, now we know Iron Thorns is fast enough to kill Urshring next turn. Urshring is going to have to return with a brick break of his own. However, he uses the body slam. What is wrong with you, Jake? You're telling me this thing doesn't have a fighting move? This thing is built for fighting. It should have, it should have been a normal fighting type. That's what they were doing with uh, Beware. That's his name, Beware. So Iron Thorns' balloon pops. And Iron Thorns gets the kill with the earthquake. Get out of here, Urshring. Finally, an upset. T the real T-Tar comes out. Battle of the Lords. Wow. Battle, Battle of the Lords. Um, this is a very crazy play right here. Um, terrestrializes into a ground type, but Josh retaliates with terrestrializing into a flying type. Wow. What a read. What a read. What a read. Arthur Reed. I like Arthur. Arthur's a fun show. So we see the read. Jake goes for earth power. Doesn't affect it. Iron Thorns goes for the dragon dance. Josh can sweep, dude. Josh is going to sweep. Josh is going to win this. Watch. He's, he's, he, he goes, switches to Sylveon. It doesn't matter. Iron Thorns pulls out the Earthquake. Immediate kill. Wow, 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 wow. What a shock. Then the real T-Tar comes out. You'll never guess what Josh is going to do. That's right. He's going to miss the Thunder Wave. He's going to pull out the Earthquake. Wow. It's almost like I know what's going to happen. He pulls the Thunder Wave, lands, Josh pulls out an Earthquake. Yippee! It's a 2v2. The 2v2. Tatsugiri versus Iron Thorns. Fuck these two. Tatsugiri uses Surf. Iron Thorn lives on a very crucial mistake for Josh because he uses Wild Charge and both Pokemon are knocked out. So now it's a Dragon Ghost versus a Flying Dark. You're... Your guess is as good as mine on who's going to win this. Because Dragapult may be insanely fast and, it may, and insanely strong, but we have a dark type with flying moves too. And, and he's fa they're both fast, but Dragapult's faster, sure. But come on, man. No terrain, no weather, no nothing. No setup. Josh, Jake goes for the T-Bolt, brings it down to less than half. However... However, this crazy play from Josh goes for the Dragon Pulse, and he doesn't kill. And you know what's going to happen? Then Dragon Pulse uses T-Bolt again, and Josh loses. Wow, big upset. Who would have thought? Wow, wow, wow. Oh my god, I hate all of you. Anyways, that's it for my probably last installment of Draft battle breakdown before I get <laughs> fired, thrown in the can, if you know what I'm talking about, nudge, nudge, wink, wink, 
Um, so as I finish off, I would like to show you guys a video. Um, um, I, I don't think I can show you guys videos. Um, so that's it. Remember, if, if there's one thing to take away from this video, it's that um, this is going to be me with Michael. Watch out for the next week. Michael Lee is going to be demolished by my son, Flora. By this team right here. Where is it? Oh, I got rid of it. But you saw the team. You, Michael, you know exactly what I'm bringing. Be prepared. Thank you. Peace out, bitches.